everyone and welcome back to my channel i know it's been a while since i've built um, um there's just been a lot of crazy things trying to balance out my work schedule and stuff like that and you know my building and that that in itself it's like a lot of work so or like the editing and stuff like that so anyway today's build is actually a collab so i will be doing doing the building part of the video and Ashley Simi Life, which I will link her uh, YouTube channel below, will actually be doing the like the decorating and stuff like that, like the inside of it. So if you want to go over there and head to her channel, uh, you can see like the finish finishing product of the video. Um, so yeah, and her again the channel to her link. I mean the the link to her channel will be down below uh, in the description. So I'm pretty excited to be doing a collab. I've never done one before. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited. And I want to say thank you all for my 52 subscribers that have subscribed to me. I am so happy. Like literally one night I was just like, oh, it's going to be 38. You know, I just looked just to see like, you know, what's going on and stuff. And it was like. 48 and I was like oh my god that's crazy it jumped from 38 to 48 so then I checked it again and it's at 52 right now so thank you all so much uh, I started with like eight subscribers and I actually didn't think I would reach anybody but thank you all so much for like the Instagram love as well all my followers there and for you guys on YouTube for watching and supporting my videos I I'm so grateful you have no idea like this is amazing thing to do um, and it takes a lot of time but I love it like I love it I love to do it so anyway let's get back to this build so this is a three bedroom four bedroom four bathroom house and then there is an office which can be converted into a room so it could be four bedrooms four bath or like the little garage area you can convert it into another room so it could be four bedroom four bath and plus a um, plus an office and I'm really excited because when I built this one I've made fake sliding doors and then we got the patch and I was kind of happy like I hadn't upload this video or finished the build yet because this house needed sliding doors so bad so it's based on like this like mountain like a mountain style home that I saw um, I don't know how to build in in the oh my gosh I forgot. you know where we go camping that forest like I don't know what that world is called I don't know how to build there if you guys know can you please let me know how to build there because I think this house would have been perfect there like a little well it's not a cabin but it's a like I wanted it to be like mountains on the back and and this build right now it's in Burlington Burlington <laughs> yeah it's a, I want to call it Burlington I, I don't know it's not Burlington but it's in the cats and dogs something bay okay <laughs> I haven't played in a while it's so bad I haven't even been building like this is like the only house I have for right now I am working on a modern base game house uh, uh, built uh, it's more like a loft kind of thing um i've decided that every week i will build at least one base game um starter house so under 20k or around there um if it's like a a starter base game family home i want to see I, I don't know how much you guys get for a family when you buy a house when you like create a sim and you have a family living like moving in and starting from scratch I'm not sure how much you get from that like with two people but I'll look into it and um, yeah I decided to like build one at least once a week um, just so that I could have a starting base game home for you all who don't have like all the packs and stuff like that and if you want me to do like a starter and one pack please let me know like what is the most popular pack below and I'll go ahead and do that and I also have some requests on Instagram where I'm building some houses for people there too. So, yeah. 
let's get back to this one this house has a a lot of like this is like the back deck area um how i am i didn't furnish it but how i imagine it it'd be like a nice little barbecue area for the family and stuff like that and there is like um there is a way to get there from the master bedroom as well um because the master bedroom has sliding doors and i did put some of the fans in here i mean i know they don't fit with like the whole mountain mountain themed but it's okay <laughs> it's fine i i wanted to use the fans i couldn't find them it took me like a good amount of time to look for those fans and i was like oh my gosh i had to like go on youtube and look at like people review it and nobody would click it and then right like when i was watching deligacy talk about it i like found it so i was like okay perfect so yeah this house is i really i was really happy that it's a collab because i wanted to do like really kind of focus on the outside and more um, I did have a lot of trouble with this roofing for some reason. Um, I really need to practice like my houses being a certain like shape where the roofs kind of meet in like a different, you know, direction type of thing. But um, I overall, I think this is a good uh, family home. Unfurnished, I think it was like 48 something. Um, like 48 something simoleons um i'm not sure how much it'll be furnished it is a pretty big uh house i think it's on a 40 by 30 lot i'm not really too sure i really wish we could mess with the terrain a little because the house that i base this on there's like a little mountain like little like lift area by the garage slash whatever room um, and it looked really nice and I really wanted to do that for this house, but you know, we can't mess with the terrain So It's okay. I think it looks pretty good either way um, Yeah, like the, the layout of this is a little not weird. It's not open open concept um, You can definitely open it up. I think from the kitchen to the um the living area um the little dining room is actually on the front i don't know if you guys saw like the little room there i do put like tables and stuff for ashley to like <laughs> know where everything like like my idea where everything will go so you'll see like where the dining room area is if it's too big you could definitely expand the dining area a little bit um and just fix the roofing on the outside and the windows i have a thing with windows having to be like super symmetric with the room and if it's not it tends to bother me a little bit <laughs> it's just so hard it's so hard like the window in the kitchen that was really tough for me to leave it's like slightly off centered but it's okay i'm trying to get the hang of doing like the windows that way so the master bedroom and master bathroom area is pretty big and I must admit I'm a little rusty with the recording I feel like I don't know what to say <laughs> um but yeah I like this house this house is pretty nice um it's pretty big I want to do a lot more family homes um I found like a traditional family homes I did find some um that I really like there's like a deck on the top on the second floor um so I think I'm thinking of doing that so yeah, see how I, like, if the window wasn't symmetric, like, it was, if the window was in the middle, I would have kept it like that. But if you all want to, you can expand the little dining room a little bit more. Um, like if you have a bigger family, like for a four bedroom, you know? Um, and yeah, again, I did use a lot of packs. Like I said, uh, I will be making more base game packs, um, at least once a week is my goal um i'm doing a lot of closing shifts this week so i'm hoping like i don't know why but i concentrate more at night and i'm working so i'm hoping like on days where i don't have to work i'm gonna probably stay up and work on builds and stuff like that 
um, yeah, so I'll be doing like just there's just like a few big houses coming your way if you all want like a small house like this one this is a three, three bedroom house um i mean like yeah like three bedrooms or four bedrooms definitely let me know i will be gladly i'll gladly do like three to four bedroom builds if you all want and this is where i switched to the sliding doors because for a while I didn't work on this build and I was like oh my god sliding doors <laughs> I was so excited when we got sliding doors and ceiling fans I thought it was like fake news <laughs> I thought it was like um I thought it was like a like a sim fan that did it and I was like oh like that sucks it's a patch like a you know I don't put like custom content in my builds I was like really disappointed I thought it was constant like custom content and then it's from the sims so I was like pretty excited I'm a little um, behind on the news just trying to balance out my life <laughs> I'm so sorry guys but after like receiving like the boost of subscribers I'm really motivated to build and I'm not okay it's not about like the subscribers but it feels good to have like an audience like that I'm reaching someone and like I've never had that in my life so that's, it's like really fun it definitely takes my mind away from a lot of things and that's what the sims is like you get to kind of escape from reality you get to do like if you do storytelling you get to do your own storytelling stuff and like that's that's what the sims is that's what the game is about and for me i get to work out like my architect dream and my uh interior design dream that never came through uh came true because of geometry <laughs> like geometry killed that dream um but yeah anyway if you all want to download this video it will be up on the gallery under bubbly simmy uh it, it will be furnished under um simply simmy life um so you can go ahead and download it there as well if you all like this video please give this video a big thumbs up and if you want to know when i upload more videos please subscribe and ding the little bell and if you want to follow me on my social media go ahead and Follow me on my Instagram, which is a Bubby Simi, and on my Twitter, which is a Bubbly Simi. And I have a question for you guys. Um, everybody searches for my channel as Bubby Simi, and I was wondering if you all think it's a good idea if I change my YouTube name from Bubbly Simi to Bubby Simi. I'm not sure. Let me know. I think it's like everybody searches for that. Uh, as my name so let me know what you all think I would like to get your opinion because I'm not sure either way so yeah thank you all so much for watching and have a bubbly day